Hi, I'm Dr. Anisa Kapadia. I'm a consultant rheumatologist. I practice in Mumbai. I'm also attached to Sefi Hospital, Jaslok Hospital, Prince Ali Khan Hospital, and Masina Hospital, as well as my own clinic, which is in Nana Chowk. Rheumatoid arthritis management is divide, uh, divided into medication, pharmacological and non-pharmacological measures. So when I mean non-pharmacological measures, I mean things like physical exercises. This is a very, very important part of rheumatoid arthritis treatment. So I tell my patients that whatever exercise you can manage on a regular basis, please carry that out. For example, this might be a brisk walk, this might be swimming, this might be yoga or whatever is possible in their day-to-day -day lifestyle. It's important to do this on a regular basis, so at least 45 minutes to one hour daily should be carried out. After that, things like stress management is important. We do know that physical or emotional stress can aggravate your disease. This should try to be managed in as the best way possible. A lot of patients ask me what can we do as far as our diet is concerned or what should we avoid or restrict in our diet. What I tell them is that uh, certain things like uh, fried foods, unhealthy uh, items like processed foods should be avoided at all costs. Not that they affect your rheumatoid arthritis uh, directly, but it's overall not good for your uh, health. Uh, other measures such as um, uh, good sleep at night, avoiding uh, smoking is also very important. Um, what about the treatment of rheumatoid arthritis? We have so many options nowadays as far as RA treatment is concerned. Initially, we might uh, give you temporary relief measures like painkillers only for a short period. But the more definitive treatment starts with drugs which are known as disease-modifying drugs. We have a lot of drugs uh, in this category. What these drugs do is that they control your inflammation and therefore prevent your need for painkillers. Steroids are something which were prescribed a lot earlier, but we now reduce them to the bare minimum possible and we avoid them as far as possible. We also have a group of drugs known as biological drugs. So when uh, normal uh, disease modifying drugs or DMARDs don't work, sometimes we do progress to biological drugs if you require them. A whole new category of oral drugs known as JAK inhibitors are now available to us and these have really uh, revolutionized or uh, be proved to be a game changer as far as treatment of rheumatoid arthritis is concerned. What drug is best for you will be decided based on your particular individual requirement, your age, your various other uh, problems such as if you have diabetes or blood pressure and more importantly, of course, on what your disease requires. So this can be done with discussion and uh, only then the decision of treatment is made. <music>